I will leave it at that. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, Elena. Gabriel Slantbergis, the Foreign Minister of Lithuania, please. Well, thank you, Tobias, uh, for welcoming us so warmly in uh, in what could be called the heart of uh, new Nordic and Baltic NATO uh, region. Uh, for for us, uh, this year and Gotland has a special uh, meaning because exactly 35 years ago, a group of uh, Lithuanians, uh, among them also some of my relatives, signed what was called a Gotland communique, expressing a will for Lithuania to gain independence, which it uh, got uh, a couple of months uh, later. And now we're returning to the same island uh, with a, in a very different world, uh, in a very different uh, environment for Sweden, for Lithuania definitely, but still with the uh, same risks in mind and with same same outlook to the future. So that's uh, that's quite clear that our discussion uh, revolved about the uh, uh, geopolitical situation that affects uh, not just our uh, friend and ally Ukraine, but also all of us um, in, in in Nordics and Baltics. And a couple of points from from our debate, which I think it's uh, uh, important. First of all, I'm truly happy and grateful that we all agree on a very simple, from first outlook matter, is that why do we help Ukraine? Uh, we help Ukraine to win. And uh, I don't know why, but in some cases it's very difficult to utter uh, these, uh, these words. Mm -hmm. But in, in this group, uh, we stand united with a very, very clear goal, because we do understand what's, what's at stake if that doesn't happen. And it's not uh, theoretical for us. Uh, it's, it's, it's a very practical, uh, practical conversation. Um, the second thing is that we are proudly among the biggest supporters of Ukraine. You know, if you take uh, even, as, as Tobias uh, mentioned, in absolute numbers. And in, in some cases, we do understand the limitations of our, uh, of our economies, of our possibility of our industries to support. But again, we can serve as an example, and it is possible. It is possible to convince your people to explain the decisions and to help as much as you can for Ukraine to win. And we hope that this example can be, um, can be used by, by, by others. And lastly, about, about the cooperation. Uh, we, do, uh, we did cover uh, through our conversations the need for a greater cooperation within ourselves. Yes, we are part of NATO, but yes, we do live in, in one region that is affected geopolitically. And from my side, you know, not only we wish to see Swedish Gripens uh, securing uh, Lithuania and the Baltic skies, but we also can promise that uh, if there is a need, Lithuanian troops will defend uh, this island and whichever island, Swedish island, together with our Swedish allies, if the need would arise. Thank you. Thank you very much, Gabriel.